the gospel. How is sin atoned for? How are fallen men and women with a corrupt human nature justified? All have sinned, all fall short of the glory of God. We are all sinners, we are all bound for hell until Jesus intervenes. How can people like us be saved, given the fact that in and of ourselves we are of no real good in this sense that God considers good, which is perfection? Be ye holy as I am holy. How can we be as holy as God? We cannot be. Be ye perfect as I am perfect. How can we have the perfection of God? We can't. It must be imputed to us. When Jesus went to the cross in our place, he took our sin to give us his righteousness. The only way we can be holy as he is holy is because it's his holiness. Amen. The only way we can be perfect as he's perfect is because it's his perfection. It's all grace. He justifies us. Amen. Our works are something we do because we've been saved, not in order to get saved. So how... Are we saved? What is the gospel? Is it a social gospel of good works? Is it sacraments, rituals, that have an ex opere operato innate capacity to save us? You think sprinkling water on a baby is going to make it a Christian? What's the gospel? Is it the Mormon celestial law? No, there's only one gospel. He who knew no sin became sin. He's the propitiation for our sins, the expiation for our sin. God became a man and was nailed to the cross in my place and rose from the dead to give me eternal life. That if I repent of my sin and put my faith in him, he will save me. That's the gospel. They got another gospel. They're not Christian. <laughs> 